How's it going, everybody? Shockwave984 here. Today is going to be a complete anime series unboxing. And it's going to be on a show that I have uh, did a video on before. It was during one of the Macross slash Robotech uh, two-part videos I did. So feel free to check those out. And I happened to find a, another part of it that I was looking for. And I actually got a comment about it. So thank you, whoever commented that. <laughs> you know who you are. And there's also another addition to our uh, Macross collection, and that is Macross Plus. So with that, let's go ahead and get started. So first up, we have the complete collection of Macross Plus, and this was done by uh, Shoji Kawamori. And this is an old uh, manga uh, entertainment release. There's their logo right there, or manga video. And you see one of our lead characters. Stuff in the background. Yeah, epic series. Uh, yeah, this is really, really good. Uh, this is not really long. Um, but for what they do, or well, I mean length wise, yeah. But uh, for what they do in here, it's just incredible. Uh, the animation is excellent. Here are the two DVDs. The voice acting is very, very good. The uh, story is actually awesome, too, the way uh, the way it's done and stuff. So what I have here, these are the OVAs. So that initially is what it is. So you have parts 1 and 2 and 3 and 4. Uh, I have found them separately. This I got secondhand uh, with the OVAs uh, together. But yeah, there's another edition that I'm going to get to in a little bit. So here's some screenshots. Or just uh, pictures. All right, and then you have a little info here, and it tells you about each volume, the story details, all four parts. All right, and then the uh, DVD features are extras. So digitally re remastered, motion menus. Yeah, that used to be a, a thing <laughs> that they would put down. English 5.1 surround sound. It is excellent. So is the Japanese stereo in English with, uh, oh, Japanese with English subtitles. SDH uh, for deaf and hearing impaired. Macross Plus musical uh, photo gallery. Japanese production team credit menus. Macross Plus trailers. Manga 2000 commercial web link. Uh, manga fan club. Commercial manga video commercial. Yeah. So quite a few stuff. And then you can get some credits here. Yeah, so director, mechanical design is Kawamori. Co-director is Shinichiro uh, Watanabe. Who you might recognize from, uh, it was Cowboy Bebop. And also other projects. Alright, so let's go ahead and take these out. Okay, so let's start with volume one. Okay, so here... It's a cover. And there's your three uh, characters here. Uh, three friends. Yeah, they uh, just kind of, you know, reunite after a long time being apart. Two of them are, like, testing these new uh, Valkyries. Uh, like, these prototypes. Yeah, I forgot to take that off. Yeah, that's just, like, a sticker. Uh, because I believe, yeah, this was sold together as, like, one box set. I think back when it was new. Here's the story details for both parts. Yeah, so they all uh, meet up uh, eventually. Uh, one uh, works with like this, uh, I guess like this this computer generated uh, singer, uh, Sharon Apple. And then the other two are test pilots and then some, well, some things happen. <laughs> and you just kind of, uh, you know, follow it from there. You also get some uh, some flashbacks of them when they were younger. And uh, uh, yeah, the way the story's done I thought was really good. So here is the disc. So I'm going to go ahead and take this out. Okay, so yeah, these are the OVA editions. So you have uh, openings, endings uh, per episode. And if you look closely on the booklet, you see our two pilots right there in the back. This little pamphlet. Oh, there's a Valkyrie right there. 
and then open it up and then you had the uh, scene uh, selections all right and then oh it tells you like how the, the menus work and stuff yeah I've been thinking of doing a menu review for this one or actually all of the macro stuff that we have just front and back together all right so that does it for parts one and two the volume one so yeah I found the box set all together yeah this still has the sticker on the top but I've found them separately many many times second hand so yeah if you find them for a good deal I say pick them up so here is volume two So shot. Okay, here's the spine. And then here's the back. Here's the details. Okay, so you have uh, Asamu and uh, Gold. Gold uh, Bowman. Yeah, those are the two uh, pilots. All right. And okay, and then and their friend uh, Myung or Myung? No, I want to say it's Myung. Yeah, that's their other friend. Now this picture, if you look right there, there is the Macross. Yeah, because uh, this is supposed to take place. Oh, I forget the timeline of it, but uh, um, yeah, because you see, it's like there's a whole uh, city built around. The Mac Cross and stuff, and just looking at it visually, man, with the the way the animation uh, was done, you could tell a lot went into this. Because uh, I remember this being a pretty big uh, deal. There's the disc art. Uh, I saw a lot of promotions for it on our old uh, anime DVDs and stuff. And uh, yeah, I've been looking for this for a long time because <laughs> we because we never owned it. There's two characters in the back. I believe that's Miyoung right here, and then that's Sharon. Apple. All right. And that same fighter. Here are these uh, chapter list. Is it my young? No, I want to say it's me young. Yeah. Okay. Here's the front and back together. All right. And that does it for the. OVA versions of Macross Plus, and I'll go ahead and show you guys the cases together. So yeah, really, really good series. Uh, just overall excellent. Yeah, really glad I was able to uh, find these. So yeah, we've had these for a while. But, there is another part of the series that you can get. So here is Macross Plus, the movie edition. And yes, this does add quite a bit. So I got a comment about this uh, when I did the two uh, parts for our uh, Robotech Macross collection. And yeah, uh, I forgot I, I was missing the movie ver uh, edition. And so glad I was able to find it. I actually got this, uh, let's see... I think like a week ago, a couple weeks ago. Yeah, it took a long time to find. Found it at a Half Price Books. Uh, one that was a little bit further out. But uh, yeah, had it, and they had it for really cheap. Okay, so this has never before seen footage. There's the story details here. Oh, right there on the top. And then on the bottom, in the middle, yeah, the movie edition includes a new opening sequence, new scenes. And it, it clarifies more of the, uh, like, relationships. So, like, stuff gets more uh, fleshed out with the characters. And you also have a new ending with extended footage of the haunting concert uh, given by the uh, singer Sharon Apple. And, yeah, it, it is what they were able to do with this is awesome. Uh, so, highly recommend getting the movie edition if you can find it. Uh, the OVAs are fine. Um, but with this one, you're actually getting a lot more, which is really cool. Uh, here are the features. You have Japanese language with uh, English subtitles, motion menus, uh, 5.1 surround, photo gallery, Japanese production team credits, uh, Macross Plus trailers, manga previews, web link, fan club. 
All right. Now, this edition, I remember, I think I remember watching this one the most. Because uh, this used to play on, oh my gosh. I think it was like Stars or something. I think it was on multiple channels. But I remember watching uh, this edition, um, also the OVA. So I've seen quite a bit of both. And, uh, oh, this also has one of those, uh, the Ultimate in Anime. Uh, this is like an old uh, pamphlet, manga video you used to put out. And it would show you like all the stuff that's being released. All the titles, or sun stuff, and then also apparel, shirts and stuff. Yeah, pretty cool. And then here's the pamphlet. A close-up shot there. And here is the back. Oh. Yeah, and this is, uh, you get a little uh, paragraph from the director. Who just did a fantastic job. Yeah, hats off to the people that worked on this. Here's the chapters. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's see the Valkyries. They actually had toys of these, too. Uh, we do have a couple of Valkyrie uh, toys and stuff. Uh, yeah, one really, uh, one big metal one <laughs> that I was able to find. Uh, I think I did find one of the test ones that are in here. Yeah, at an old toy store. And there's a shot of the city. Yeah, look at that. That is cool. And then here's the front and back together. All right, and that does it for Macross Plus. So yeah, I wanted to do this one separately after finding the movie edition. This took me a long time <laughs> to pick up. Uh, but yeah, really, really cool. Uh, definitely check out Macross Plus. And as a bonus here, I'm going to uh, show you guys something else that I added to our collection. And that is Robotech. The two movie collection of the Shadow Chronicles Collector's Edition. We do have that on Blu-ray. And Love Live Alive. The premiere release. Because I also got a comment about this, this one as well. Uh, I didn't have this initially. And uh, yeah, I happened to find it. So I found this at a Raspbian Music. For super, super cheap. I think it was like two, three bucks. And uh, this is, a, I guess, an A&E release. And then I happened to find it even more after that. <laughs> like at another Half Rice Books, another uh, place I go to called Amoeba Music. They had it. So I was like, all right, I'm finding it everywhere now. <laughs> so here is the, uh, the details. So the big thing with this is Love Live Alive. This was uh, the premiere uh, release for it. And special features wise, uh, so on the left is Shadow Chronicles, on the right is uh, Love Live. So yeah, special features, pre-production gallery and teaser, uh, that's for Love Live Alive. Uh, Chronicles, you have over 70 minutes of featurettes. This one had a lot of stuff. Uh, deleted scenes, outtakes, animatics, trailers, photo galleries. Uh, English 5.1's uh, Adobe Digital Audio, Spanish subtitles, English for the uh, SDH. Deaf and hearing impaired. And there you see the Harmony Gold logo. In 1985 to 2003. And yeah, Harmony Gold was the company that brought us uh, pretty much Robotech and all that stuff. Yeah, put all the series together. So there is Love Live Alive. I'm going to take these out. Give you guys a closer look. So thinking back, I'm not sure if I've ever seen this. I may have seen like a little uh, mini preview for it, uh, but after watching it, this is really good. Yeah, this this is cool. Uh, really glad I was able to find this. I think this might have been part of another Robotech box set that came out, because um, there's several. We have the big blue one that I eventually found, but um, there was another one uh, that came out after, and I think uh, Alive was part of that, and I think Chronicles was also part of it. Part of that, yeah. So here is the Shadow Chronicles. All right, and yeah, that does it for the two movie collection. So now we can add that, and I also have two more bonuses for you guys because uh, I do apologize for the lack of videos and stuff. Uh, this month has been rough 
uh, so far. Uh, it is the month of my birthday, <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, so I, do, I did take some time off towards the end of the month. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to show you guys some stuff that I picked up. Here's another addition to our Lupin the Third or Lupin the Third collection. We have Jigen's Gravestone. And I really love that cover. That is awesome. It is reversible. So this is uh, released by Discotech. Hats off to them. They're pretty much uh, releasing all of, if not most, of the Lupin the Third stuff. Life and Death at the Excuse me. Life and death at the roll of a die. I thought I said dice there for a second. <laughs> so there's Jigen on the top. Here's the story details right there. Hopefully you guys can see that. I know it's really small. And I get some screenshots. Uh, special features, both Japanese and English language versions. Japanese trailers. So yeah, not a heck of a lot. Region is a Japanese DTS uh, HD Master Audio and English uh, 2.0. Subtitles, full English subtitles, signs, and they, oh, even the signs have subtitles on them. All right, and yeah, I'll go ahead and un unbox this for you guys. Okay, so there is Jigen's Gravestone. Yeah, look at that, I like the black and white. That is awesome. And by the way, it looks excellent on blu-ray uh yeah a lot of these are getting blu-ray releases these movies uh these specials and here's the reverse cover yeah it's all one picture and then we have uh something about jigen going on so yeah uh the person that uh you know they're taking on may or may not uh has something against Jigen himself. Then also you have Lupin. Just part of it as well. Uh, I want to say Fujiko is too. Uh, this was awesome. Uh, what I've noticed with a lot of these films with Lupin. A bunch of them have like their own distinct style. Like they're done by many different companies. And stuff. And uh, yeah. This is, this is another really good one. Definitely check out Jigen's uh, Greystone. And last up. This is a uh, rebuy because the first uh, time I got this, this is when Marnie was there. I put it in the plastic. Uh, there was no title on the spine. It's really weird. Uh, I got this at Barnes and Noble. I think others got it like that as well. And then, you know, way down the road, months later, <laughs> recently, I went back uh, to get some uh, manga books and stuff, uh, other DVDs, and they happened to have it with the title. Right there on the spine, so I guess it got uh, fixed or something. So yeah, I'm gonna give one of these to like maybe my cousin or something, or maybe one of my brothers. But uh, yeah, found it with the uh, spine when Marnie was there. Another Studio Ghibli film. Uh, this was very very good. Uh, the disc art and all that's all the same. Uh, special features. So yeah, highly recommend this one. Great job out of cast. And uh, yeah, so that does it for. Macross Plus, and some bonus items for you guys as well. So let's go ahead and display. Uh, you know what? Let's display everything. So let's put. I'll take out the box. That right there. Or no, I'll just display uh, Macross Plus. Yeah. All right. Leave the bonus items. It was like a surprise. <laughs> and uh, yeah, there they are. All look good together. So yeah, feel free to let me know. Uh, have you guys seen Macross Plus? Uh, also, uh, which uh, edition did you see? Did you see the original OVAs? Uh, the movie edition? Uh, also, uh, The Shadow Chronicles and Love Live Alive. Yeah, this set, if you could find that, um, definitely pick that up. Uh, it's worth it just for the Love Live Alive. You know, uh, it's a premiere release, which was a big deal at the time the movie edition for plus uh is excellent the new footage the uh uh extended yeah just extended scenes the new opening new ending uh stuff with the characters get more fleshed out uh which is excellent and even the ova editions they're fine on their own uh they're still really really good uh animation wise excellent voice acting really good uh me macross uh 
music. Very well known for having really good uh, songs and stuff. This one uh, has that as well. And uh, yeah, so with that, feel free to let me know what you guys think. And I'll see you guys next time.